Welcome to your weekly UAS news update. We have three stories for you this week. More Mavic 4 leaks. We have a press release on the New Jersey drones. And then lastly, the Colorado police uses a drone to find a skier. Let's get to it. And first up this week, more Mavic 4 leaks, which I know a lot of people are waiting for. Uh, the rumors include a change in the three camera setup uh, with a 1X camera that would have an aperture of f over 2.0, a 2.5X instead of the 3X we've seen before with an f 2.0 as well. And then lastly, a 6X instead of a 5X zoom to finish the whole package. Now the 1X and the 2.5X are rumored to have D-Log while the 6X does not uh, look like it has it. Other leaks include images of the upper body plastic which appears to show either a port on the top or possibly a built-in light. Uh, we're slowly getting better and better pictures so we might be getting closer to an actual release. Uh, the current rumored release is April but we may actually see it a little bit sooner. Now I don't know for sure so I'm just making this up for right now. Next up, the White House had a press conference about the New Jersey drones this week. During the press conference, it was stated that after research and study, the drones that were flying over New Jersey in large numbers were authorized to be flown by the FAA for research and various other reasons. Currently, it's unclear what the other reasons are and uh, how many of the reported drone sightings were truly drones and how many were actually airplanes. Now, hopefully this is the end of this and it puts an end to, well, this whole saga. Last up, Colorado police used a drone to guide a skier down to safety. Now, the skier became lost and had trouble navigating back to the trailhead. The Summit County Sheriff's Office used a drone to maintain line of sight with the skier and assist them with navigating back to the trailhead. Uh, this operation saved the backcountry rescue team from deploying, which would have resulted in a multi-hour operation with four to six ground team members uh, trekking to the last person. So, a great job on Summit County's part. Uh, glad to to see drones being used for good. And then join us later today for the happy hour in the community. We also have a live Q&A on Monday on YouTube and then post-flight, which is available in the premium community on Monday. And we'll see you then.